Hello, and welcome back to another episode of Collegia's Cooking, and that's cooking with a guy. So for this episode, we're making smothered pork chops, okay? So I got the turkey stuff in, I got some, some beans, I got some pork chops here. So we're gonna go wash my hands and wash the meat, and then we're gonna be right back. I know I said I ain't gonna tell you how to how to wash no meat if you don't know how to wash no meat, but you don't go watch another video, okay? So yeah, I'll be right back. Meat loaf, damn you know how good that tastes. And you know what's up, you never miss a thing on Adria's cooking show. And that's cooking with the K. Now we're going to season them. Let me spread them out. seasoning some onion powder and some garlic powder Now we're gonna flip them over and do the same seasonings. And some paprika. I think I forgot paprika on the other side, but put paprika. And now we're gonna go to the stove and fry this up. Okay, so now we're going to put them in here. And just so you know, I am going to wash this out because that's raw meat. So before I put them back in there, I'm going to wash it out. And I did, I did put a little bit of oil in there prior to, you know, cooking it. And I'll be back when the pork chops are cooked. Okay, look about done. Let's see. We're gonna take them out. And I'll be back to you when they're all done. And yes, I did clean it out. See, like I said, this cross contamination. Now we're gonna cook the stuffing, okay? I have one and a half cups of chicken stock on the stove. And once that's done boiling, we're gonna put the stuffing mix in with some butter. And then we're going to cook it up for a few minutes and then put it over, over top, okay? Now that it's boiling, we're gonna add one fourth of a stick of butter. So one fourth cups of a stick of butter, which is four tablespoons of butter. I have it right here, we're gonna plop it in and mix. Now we're going to put the stuffing in. Now we're gonna put a lid on it and let it sit for five minutes. So now I'm gonna use a 22 ounce can of Bush's baked beans. You usually use a 28 one, you know, the big the big ones, but the one can, but since we got 22, we're just gonna add 
two of them, okay? I know it's not 28, it's like a little more, but who cares? Let me show you. Now we're gonna put our pork chops in. Now we have to layer the stuffing right on top. So we we'll put aluminum foil on it and I'm going to put it in the oven for about 40 to 45 minutes, okay? And I'll get back to you when it's all done so you can see the final reveal. You can see right there and now I'm about to put it in the oven. And then the video said if you want it crispy, you can put it, you can take the aluminum foil off the last 10, 15 minutes, but I'm not gonna do that. So just leave it in there for about 45 minutes. Now it's most likely 44, but 45 minutes. Here is the smothered pork chops. They look real good. And let me get a better look. Look at the beans. Look at it. Yes, it looks delicious, okay? Let me taste it. Okay, we got this little stuffing, the pork chop, and okay. Mmm, that's really good. Okay, so town ten must try. Don't forget to So don't forget to give this video a like, thumbs up, comment, subscribe. Yeah, do that shit. And I'll see you next video. Bye.